Today's lesson is how to create an XML sitemap for Google or any search engine to crawl your website. My name is Charles and I work for LiveMobileTechnology.com. I'm a web and mobile app developer. As an experienced developer, I want to share all of my knowledge and experience to YouTube and I hope this lesson helps you understand how to create a sitemap. What is XML sitemap? XML sitemap tells your search engine like Google or Bing or Yahoo to find out what pages you have on your site and you can update this sitemap every time you have a new page etc. To create a sitemap follow these steps. Step 1 go to any website that helps you generate a sitemap. I am using xml-sitemaps.com So in the step one, you just go to the browser, type in that URL, xml-sitemaps.com. Step two, step two, type in your website domain. In this case, we use livemobiletechnology.com. Step three, make sure this field is set to none. This value indicates how frequently the content at a particular URL is likely to change. In this case, we use none. Step four, the time the URL was last modified. This information allows crawlers to avoid recrawling documents that haven't changed. You can let the generator set this field from your server's response headers to specify your own date and time. So in this case, we use server's response. Step five, leave on automatically calculate. Step six, click on the here button link and it will download your sitemap. Basically, it takes you to a opening your sitemap by downloading it. You save it to your typical download folder. And then when this pops up, just click on OK. That will basically save it to the uh, download folder. Step 8. Download the sitemap.xml file and upload it into the domain root folder of your site. In this case, I use livemobiletechnology.com as a site sample. You have to use FTP software to do this. I use FileZilla FTP. You can get the FTP software at www.filezilla.com. After uploading sitemap.xml to your public underscore HTML, this is where it looks like. Step 9. Check that the sitemap is showing for you at livemobiletechnology.com slash sitemap.xml. This is the website that you will upload the sitemap dot xml as an example so if your domain is at domain.com then make sure you have a it's uploaded to the root and it will be domain.com slash sitemap dot xml then go to your google webmaster account and add your sitemap url Step 10. Once you log into the Google Webmaster account, you just upload your sitemap.xml and Google will crawl for you. So, step 1. Go to the Webmaster Tools by going to google.com slash webmasters. 
you can click on Webmasters Tools and it will basically take you to the Webmaster Tools. And this is how the Webmaster Tool look like. Step three, click on your website name you created. In this case, it's LiveMobileTechnology.com as an example. Step four, click on sitemaps on the left side. You see that menu right there? You click sitemaps. Step five, click on add slash test sitemap right there. Step six, enter your sitemap name. So how did you get your sitemap name? I showed you previously. So you just now have to enter sitemap.xml and basically click on submit sitemap. And after that, it basically Google will web crawl your sitemap. And you are now done with sitemap uploading. Thanks for watching my video and if you like this video please give me a thumbs up. Click on the like button on the bottom left of this video. If you have any question drop me a comment and I will try to respond as soon as I can.